This is one of the best games that, that I played in the American Championship in 1963. I, I crushed everyone and scored 11 points out of 11. This was a feat that no one has ever done since. You, know, you have to find the moves I played. Um, are you up to the challenge? The opening starts quite boring, so let's, um, let's go through the moves quickly and get to your first challenge. Only a complete wimp would play this move. This is another pathetic move showing a lack of ambition. Queen to b3 would have maintained more tension. Do you know that Patty Smith once asked me out for drinks? Unfortunately, I could not go. I was practicing my rook ending. My last girlfriend was cross-eyed. I had to end it with her. I found out she was seeing someone else. This position is, of course, equal, but I knew that I could outplay my weak opponent here. What is the best way to put pressure on his position? The best square. The bishop has good range here. Well, after, after this move, I think that white's position is slightly superior and at worst completely safe. To turn this into a baiting position and 11 more moves is more witchcraft than chess. Quite honestly, I was a fucking legend. The position is as dry as the desert. What should I play now? I love bishops. I even dream of them. Here's a, line, here's a limerick that I once made about um, bishops. Yes, there was a young lady from Q who said that as the bishop withdrew, oh, the, the vicar is quicker and thicker and slicker and four inches longer than you. I was a bit worried about weakening my queen's pawn but felt that the tremendous activity obtained by my minor pieces would permit white no time to exploit it. And we need to add some fire to the board. Add another to those melancholy case histories entitled The Wrong Rook. This is very much a case of the wrong rook. One can understand Burns' desire to break the pin on the E2 knight. But this turns out to be less important than other considerations. I spent a lot of time and energy analyzing the the superior 14 rook a to d1, but came to the conclusion that black can keep the advantage. What should I now play? Now it is all system go. My pieces fly into life. My play from here is slicker than a greased weasel poo sliding down an iced lolly. There is hardly any other defense to the threat of knight to e4. In this position, how did I now make my opponent cry like a little baby? The key to my previous play the complete justification for this sacrifice does not become apparent until light resigns. You know, uh, you're, you're an introvert and you have inside jokes with yourself. <laughs> Always look for checks. Uh, checks are good. I love checks. If I had kids, I would call them little checks. Am I weird? What? Vern said afterwards that he now sat pondering why I would choose such a line because it was so obviously lost for black. But of course he was blind to my brilliance. What did I play? Burn now commentated, this dazzling move came as the shocker. The culminating combination is of such depth that even at the very moment at which I resigned, both grandmasters who were commenting on the play for the spectators in a separate room believed that Burn had a one game. Idiots. And that was my idea. Of course, uh, I open up the uh, light squares for my bishop. By the way, who the fuck is this Magnus Carlsen? The king is at black's mercy. This reminds me of a, a joke I heard. Uh, who is strong enough to move the king's castle? A chess player. Good joke, right? Bob Wade now commentated. In a room set aside for commentaries on the games in progress, two grandmasters were stating for the benefit of the spectators that Byrne had a one game. Byrne's reply to my next move must have been jaw-dropping. What did I play? And White resigns. Bitter disappointment. I'd hoped for. Queen in front of the king. The queen comes in. The king has to move. I'll put that in your pipe and smoke it, bird. What a move. I doubt Manus would have found such an idea. That is why I was the greatest. Rook takes rook. Bishop takes knight with checkmate to follow soon. A very easy game. Do you find the moves? This game was just one of the 11 games that I won this year. The best ever performance. Ask yourself, could anyone get maximum points now? No, that is why I was uh, the greatest player of all time.